Marcus Conti reporting. Check this guy out. So, so here we are a day later, right? 24 hours have passed in the, uh, in the 12 dead in California shooting in the bar and the Thousand Oaks bar. So I'll dry, dive right in here, right? So, fucking, so we got a name, right? His name is Ian Dave Long. I'm, I stay in the evidence. Right? If you don't like that shit, if you, if you, you know, if you want to, if you want to fall into the emotion of the moment. And you want to get torn into all the fucking drama. Go ahead. Don't t change the channel. Right? If you want to hear the evidence. And you want to analyze the evidence. Then you're in the right place. So we've got the guy. His name is Ian David Long. 28 years old. California resident. As usual. He, they define him as emotionally unstable. Loner. Weird. The gun was legal. He's a student at 28 years old. Ex-Marine for nine years. All right. So that's what we're going to talk about today. But before we do that, I got to tell you something. Man. Fucking, I got to, I got to thank this guy. This is, this is, um, this is uh, Mark Hodgkin. Hodge. I'm sorry, I fucked up your name, man. Mark uh, Hodge, Hodgson, and he's with uh, Mac M A N C Land, right? He did this fucking amazing fucking logo. Check this shit out, man. I might use this. I, I, I might be switching out my, uh, I might be switching out the ghost of this thing. Look at this fucking guy. Oh, my nigga. <laughs> Look at fucking Conti. He's a rock star. Oh, shit. It's like, it's like, uh, it's like Kiss. <laughs> fucking poison. Appetite for destruction. Guns and Roses fucking shit is dope, man. Shit is dope. Oh, he's got one with the flag, too. Fuck, hey, my nigga. My nigga fucking hook me up, man. My nigga hook me up. Oh, shit. Fuck, my nigga. Don't give me shit up, man. Hook your brother up. So, uh, that might be the new logo, man. I love this shit, man. Fucking guys are hooking me up, man. Fucking hooking up a brother. So, uh, that's, I mean, it's awesome, man. Thank you so much, my, uh, Mark, I don't know what you post under, so I don't know. I was going to put your your handle. <laughs> but anyway, it's Mark uh, H-O-D-G-S-O-N, Hodge, son. So, so let's get back into this. So here we go. Um, I don't know. I mean, I, I, that, that, that was a pretty powerful performance by the father, right? If he was the father. What do we know about the thing, right? So we know that... What I have not seen, right? See, see, censorship. I want to. I want to tell a story first, right? You know, everybody bashes Al Jazeera, right? The the uh, oh, the Muslims. They show fucking heads getting chopped off, and they show fucking, you know, dead bodies in the street. Uh, you know what? That's a good thing because at least we get to see the body, right? See again, evidence. I'm going to play a lot of emotion, but I have not seen twenty fourth. It's almost thirty six hours later. I have not seen any evidence. Of bullets, am I a cynic? Am I? I mean, just show me the evidence. That's all I want to see. Show me a body. Show me, show me gore. Show me someone who saw. Who, someone, show me a, a somebody with a bullet fucking hole in their arm. Yeah, that's all, right? See, like in the old <clears throat> Al Jazeera, right? Shows that stuff. When a bomb goes off, they show the fucking legs flying, and they show the. They show the gore. They show the headless person. They show, they prove to us that this is what happened. 
But in this country, oh no, no, you can't show you can't show that because it, it offends the family and it offends it offends people. But in Hollywood, you could blow people up and pieces go flying and fucking you could show all that, but but now be, when it's real, you can't show it. What the fuck is wrong with us, man? This is see, this is how censorship it keeps the it keeps the truth away from the people. That's why it's a bad thing. That's why the PMRC in the eighty in the nineties was a bad thing. That's why censoring commentary is a bad thing. That's why censoring the news to be politically correct, so you might have as not to off, uh, offend somebody. Right is is it, it keeps us from the truth. That's the topic that I want to talk about. I know everybody's got a fucking angle on this, but that's that's my immediate take. Just show me the show me the bullets, show me the blood, show me the ballistics, show me the body. Right, one well, you know another thing. Like I'm I, I come from the uh, uh, you know New York City, fucking crazy people, right. I'm going to show a couple more videos. So this this might this might go 20 minutes. So, um, and you know when someone like a gangster or somebody gets shot, like I remember. I mean, I I grew up around that stuff. I grew up around all the old men who were gangsters, you know, Gotti and not Gotti but Bellotti and Paul Castellano, all the Italians in Staten Island, right? We were kids, and and when they would get shot, one of these guys would die. The gangsters would line up in front of the funeral home to see the body. Uh, everybody, they want to, they go oh, kiss the, pick up the guy's ring, fucking kiss the guy's ring in the coffin, right? They want to go over there and see if he's dead, right? That's the point of it. So, what I'm saying, okay, we got twelve dead bodies. Okay, well, let's see some. Let's see some. Is it disrespectful to go to a funeral and want to see a dead body? Is it disrespectful to want to see a bullet hole in someone or or a fucking you know? Something, something that confirms that what we're seeing is what we're seeing. Instead of this Hollywood shit, we just saw it with a fake bomber, right? Guy who sends fake bombs, no evidence. We're not done with that. But right now we're here, right? But we're just moving on to the next very, very thin story. The synagogue shooter wasn't as thin. I didn't dive into that because I didn't. It, it wasn't, it, it didn't strike me as profound as this one does. So what do we have? We've got, we've got, um, I mean, we've got evidence, we've got evidence that, the, I, again, for the flags are here is that the shooter, so he's that loner, but not the shooter, but the people that were in the club were also in the Las Vegas shooting crowd. The same country fucking country music listeners were in the crowd. And there's six cops in the crowd. In the club. Un, un, unarmed. Uh, unarmed and un, ununiformed. And there's military all over the place. Right? There's, there's, a, there's the Marines in there. There's guys, fucking guys in the Navy. It doesn't, I, I mean, come on. Let's, here's, some, here's some shit, right? So let's look at some reactions. Oh, this. Oh, let's look at this guy. Here, Brendan's father and I went to Long Beach State together. We've known each other for most of our lives. Brendan, you were there last night. Just tell me what you went through and what you, what was going on. Ooh, check sure, this guy. As a, uh, as a regular borderline, there two, three times a week. Uh, we had only been there for maybe forty-five minutes to an hour, and uh, they were about to teach a, a dance, and I noticed that the lights were on for for everybody to, during the dance, and having a good time doing a dance and all of a sudden you just hear like a first few shots pop, pop. and being in the military being in the marine corps I'm, I'm aware of what that sounds like especially in an enclosed area and so uh i grabbed basically whoever i could around me and just threw them to the ground tried to look at where it was coming from uh so first of all he says he didn't he didn't see anything all he did was hurt papa pa. he's a military guy he was in the room smart kid articulate not emotional and he's telling you the story. He's telling you that he was in the room and and, uh, and and he heard shots. He's trained to hear shots. The fuck is this guy, right? He's trained to hear shots, but he didn't see anything, right? Now, and the, also his testimony that there were smoke bombs thrown, right? 
the first report was he had a beard on and he had a, a beanie and they were trying to they, they were going to go in the direction of the the Arab terrorists but that didn't work out now he's a fucking you know four hours six hours after the fact now he's a he's a he's a weird white kid right whatever but but this this kid's very interesting let's listen to more of what he has to say and just as soon as I identified where the target was or where the threat was I grabbed at least two people around me and yanked them as hard as I could to, to get to the nearest exit which happened to be to my rear uh, which normally is not an exit that we go out of but given the circumstances we just got out as it's fight or flight at that point your training went into went into play here talk about how you just went into that mode and started getting people out uh, it's a lot less thinking and it's more doing and acting at that point there's no there's not time for emotions to be involved um, you just have to do you have to act because it's People's lives are on the line, um, whether that's uh, getting them in a few seconds later or a minute later. Whoever you can get out as fast as you can, that's what i not only been trained to do, but I'm raised to do by my family. You were at the Vegas shooting last year. 13 months later, months later, you got to deal Sorry with this. That. How do you mentally just hold up? Did you hear that? You he was last year and then last night. I'm sorry. I'll play it again. It's too close to home. How do you mentally just hold up after what you experienced last year and then last night? It's too close to home. All right, so he was, I, 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 want, I want you to hear him say it. And that's what I not only been trained to do, but he was in the Vegas shooting. By my family. You were at the Vegas shooting last year. 13 months later, months later, you got to deal with this. How do you mentally just hold up after what you experienced last year and then last night? It's too close to home. Uh, you know, we, Borderline was our safe space after, uh, for lack of a better term, it was our home for, for the probably 30 or 45 of us that were all from the greater Ventura County area that were in Vegas. And that was our place that we went to the following week, three nights in a row, just so we could be with each other. And for, for a place that's been there for decades that everyone loves to go line dance and have a good time for somebody to, to have such a... Let's stop right there for a second. So 30 to 45 people, this guy is confirming the 30 to 45 people that were in this club were also in the Las Vegas shooting club. How, co how is that a coincidence? Right? Is that, I mean, come on, is that, is that, is that coincidence? I mean, that just doesn't make sense. I mean, that is just, I mean, we now we're saying is it that was he, you know, was the shooter, you know, the other discrepancy with the shooter is that how did the shooter, they said that the shooter, when the police finally entered, the shooter was dead. The cop entered, shots are fired, and then they came back and he's dead. Now, did he kill himself? Was there someone else, if it's a, if it's a CIA kind of, you know, set up, and the cop doesn't know what he's running into, and he's a he's a throwaway. You know, there's so many scenarios that could go on. Was there a second shooter in the room that that knocked the kid out? Uh, there's, there, it just doesn't it doesn't add up. It doesn't add up, right? I want to see. I mean, if you're in California, and there's 12 people, I know, I know. Oh, it's so painful. I know. It's so. It's such a disrespect to, to question the facts. Oh, no, 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 you can't do that. No, not in America. That's not politically correct. You have to, you have to respect the family. No, 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 you can't ask, is, is this person dead? Who is the person? You can't ask that shit. But if you're in California, get your ass to a funeral and pay your respects. Let's see, Martin's jerk off. Act of violence, it it's truly heartbreaking, and it and it really it hits really close to home for everyone in the Newbury Park, Thousand Oaks area, and beyond. What was it like when you were able to get a hold of your mom and dad and say, "Hey, you're okay"? It was a phone call I was hoping I never had to make again, but I did. Um, uh, I said about him, fuck him. Yeah. Right. So that that's an interesting. It's an interesting guy, right? He's a Marine. Come on, shut up, man. 
So so he's a marine. He's a you know he's a he, he's a trained guy in the room. Let's look at one more. I got one more clip I'll play, and then I'll talk some more about this. Uh, the, here's some pure emotion. Here's some fucking crazy ass emotion. Love this shit. Ready for this shit? Let's just. We were dancing and I saw someone walk in and um, then after that I just, I saw the shots go off and we just got down. I don't even, it was such a blur. It just happened. Shot in front of us. Traumatic, right? Man, they could be victims. You know, they they could be. They were in a place, and ba 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 ba. But nobody. There's still. There's no evidence. I mean, I I looked at twenty, thirty, forty, fifty videos so far. I try to find somebody out there who was inside the bar and has some kind of scene. I you know this 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 five hundred how many eighty ninety a hundred college kids and. And nobody took a picture. Nobody had their camera out. Nobody was streaming live on Facebook. Fucking dance for <laughs> You know, no, nothing. No no video. Nothing. All we have is the fake news media, ABC, NBC, CBS, NPR. Everybody's spinning the, the emotion of the, of the matter. But just show me the facts. That's all I want to see. That's all I want to see over here. I mean, and, there's, and I know that's what you want to see, too. Is just give us the fucking facts. All right, so censorship, that's the, that, see, the theme here is, is desensitize, desensitize people to, to the, sensitize people to the emotion and, and steer them away from the evidence. That's where we're at. I mean, that's what we saw with Cesar Altieri Sayak, Sayop, right? It was all about the, the emotion of his his, his, quote, hate crime towards the president of the United States, Trump. But there was no evidence to suggest that that was the guy that did it. It's like an 80-20 mix. 80%, 80% emotion and 20% evidence. I would like to see it the other way. Right. So, just to conclude, so far, we'll keep going with this. Because it does, it, so far it's... It's 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 uh, it's innocent until proven guilty, meaning that. Well, I don't know what I mean, but it, it doesn't it it is it, it doesn't seem to be. What they said it is right. That's all I'm saying, right? Because there's no because of the media. We're not getting we're not getting the we're getting the emotion of the story. We don't have any real facts. If I'm missing it, drop it below, man. To let me know. Right, and, you know, real facts in the matter, real, real evidence that that these people were actually killed. The cop, right? See, all the people, all the players in this appear to be military and police. Right? Those are those are establishment people. Right? Th those are those are. Um, Bought and paid for. Military people don't, don't, you know, they don't speak out. Police, are, you do as you're told or you're fired, right? So, I don't know. There's, there's a lot of loose ends in this case. I don't see any evidence 
of actual bodies. If we start hearing funerals, oh, they're closed casket. Oh, the family doesn't want to, they want to keep, stay private. And there's, you know, nobody, you could go into a wake and take, snap a fucking picture of the body, man. Go into the, go into the funeral and take a picture of the fucking guy laying in the casket, man. Poke. Poke, is he dead? Is it him? Take a picture of his face. Fucking poke around, man. Poke around, California. Find out. Students. Students, your country's under siege. Motherfuckers. My name is Marcus Conti reporting. Peace.